Good afternoon everyone and welcome and look where we are we're on the river <laughs> we're on on the beach well yeah well where else would I be so <laughs> uh, I'm at South Withering City though so this is Saturday the Tuesday the 13th no, no, no. sorry bear with me I think it's the 10th I think it's the 10th day Saturday the 10th of December so oh now the Christmas let's hope we all get something good eh yeah, so I'm at Witheringsea, um, South Witheringsea, where I fished with Vern last time. Today, I mean, uh, one man and his rod, Russ is here. Uh, his buddy, I don't know his name, but I'll find his name out. Marcus is coming, and we should, should be joined by Jimmy Cobbites, if he turns up, if he comes. Uh, Big Dan from UKC Fishing with Big Dan, he's not very well, so get well soon, Dan. I hope by the time you see this video, you're all better, and we've made another video if that makes sense so yeah um i don't know what's going to happen i don't know how it's been fishing it's been roughed up all week uh today it looks absolutely spot on for a cod or two not to say that i'm going to get them but i'm not bothered ready to enjoy ourselves let's see how we get on so yeah cue the titles and you know the drill see you soon did i really just do that <laughs> Or a lob on. See you in a bit. The famous cod corner. Let's hope it lives up to its name tonight. Let's see if we can do some damage. A bit of kiss sack a day, a bit of kiss. Back, <laughs> Decent dog fish on the air rig. Great bite, absolutely fantastic bite. Oh, but welcome back, we're here again on the beach. What a night, what a night. Oh my way. So yeah, we're at uh, Ratkinsey today, in the uh, Onsey Open. <laughs> absolutely buzzing, look at that. Oh, that's Godfather. Right, so that's both rods out. Uh, one on a running ledger, and one on a short pulley, uh, pulley panel. Pulley panel's got fresh lug on and the running ledge has got squid nice. taking a bit of battering because the sea's playing up a little bit but there's no wind so we should tell if we get a bite all right so yeah hey up Marcus you all right Says don't spend no money. <laughs> <laughs> Back chance of that up there, that. <laughs> nah, don't worry about it, mate. No, so. Oh, you don't you later on, No, I'll give it to you now before I forget. Cheers, Mocker. Thank you. No worries. Oh. No, Jimmy, I don't know what Jimmy. Jimmy's still waiting for his um, brother no, to bring his bait. But now are you saying about going. Um, yeah, he's probably going to go on the river, isn't he? Well, I said to him, as Ross is driving, I might stay out. Because I said, I'll fish here till night and then go pull at yeah, night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he said, all right. And I said, well, we might as well come here. He goes, well, because his brother got his bait, his brother can check him where he's going. Right. I went, well, no, because it's your bait. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, we'll see, we'll see. We'll see, yeah, yeah. How much would it cost extra to get one of those printed on the front as well? What's that? So I've got my logo on the back and there's yeah. a logo on the front. What cost you any extra? Oh, okay. I'll just I'll tell it to stick it on for you, Marcus. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll message her and let her know. Yeah, all right, mate. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. No worries. Marcus, Marcus is here. A few on the beach today, anyway. Well, this afternoon, going into tonight, there's a few on. So we'll see. We'll see. I've not seen anything come off yet. when I bring it in that the rigs are okay. Um, Russ had a drop down pulley on and it 
I was going to put one on myself, but it all taffled up. I think the swell's too heavy for it, to be fair. So, come with a straight pulley, running ledger, basic as you like. See how we get on. See you in a bit. First one. Well, they've both been out about 20 minutes now, so I'm going to uh, going to bring it in. I'm going to bring a little wave in first. I'm interested just to see what state the rigs are in, so uh, get a bearing on and what I want to do next. So I'll bring this in. Let you watch me. Someone's had a go at it. Hopefully not the crabs. <laughs> right, I'll get right. This. So the right hand rod is pulled right right round, so I'm gonna bring it in. I don't think there's out on it, but it's just pulled right round to the right. In fact, it's my other rod, what's gone straight, so I'm going to have to bring it in.
we're going to move back somewhat because that's racing in that dad so sorry i have to stir up my fizzog for a little bit a plonky there and i'll uh, see you soon or see you in a bit i can't get my words out It starts playing on your mind, doesn't it? And you start thinking, oh god. I wonder what state I wonder if there'll be a fish on. It it really does, right, mate. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. I'll turn, turn my camera off. Right on, mate. Right, I'm gonna get this baited back up and send back out again. Well, looks like we missed our first bite. Never mind. Let's hope it won't be the only bite of the night. As you can see, got the rig sharks on. Just had a couple of off the grounds with them and they stayed on. Can't believe it. <laughs> but yeah, the bob on them. Love them. Got me sent a fancy new uh, net all look from Damel Tech. In with a fancy cover look. Beautiful. Really nice bit of kit actually. So 
thanks Dave from Dameltech. No, I didn't get it for free, I did buy it. And uh, oh, my li lid lifter as well, from the same company. I had them a while and it took me a while to uh, sort them out. But I eventually bit the bullet and did it. But it's in a lid, lid lifter, so I'm gonna get bashed on the back of the nuts. When I'm on my box, uh, when I'm going in my box, so yeah. Holding us cod five, gone all high tech. <laughs> Them rollers are coming in now. According to the Met Office, it was supposed to be uh, going down to a 0.9 as well. That's a big ass 0.9 to me. Bring in the right hand rod. Been out a while. That tide's creeping up, so I'm gonna have to move up the beach again. So I'll get it in sharpish. Uh, 50 right round to the right again. Right, 
back up the beach we go and I'll uh, put the camera back on if that happens. See you in a bit. Wow, this swell is hammering us. <laughs> or the surf, sorry. Uh, it's smashing into us. Oh man, that's mad. Not a breath of wind though. It's absolutely perfect. It's not even cold. That's some serious surf on today. I just dropped down to one rod because getting tackled up with each other. So I've just gone a big bunch of lug, big bunch of lug on the uh, short pulley panel. panel. He wades right. So I'm going to end up with a load of worm here, <laughs> a load of worm spare. I think our tides are on about 10 to 6. It's 25 past 4 now. Hour and a half, yeah. Might have to move up the beach a bit more yet. That surf's enormous. I don't think you can see it here picking it up. So while well, I'm here, I just want to thank uh, Jim and our tackle, Wes, uh, Wesley, for uh, sending us some gear for me to have a look at and review, which I will do. Um, absolutely amazing. Thank you so much, Jim and our tackle. That's a brilliant gesture. Um, and I will do it justice by making some rigs up and reviewing it. <laughs> That'll be good. It's Christmas sorted. It was like Christmas yesterday when that came. Bloody hell. Absolutely amazing, so thank you very much. And thank you Sakuma for the hooks and cocks and roll. Absolutely brilliant. But yeah, I'm looking forward to that Gemini, Gemini tackle. Uh, I'm using all them bits and pieces, there's all sorts. It's absolutely fantastic, I can't thank you enough, honestly. Cheers, Wesley. What a great company. I hope we catch them at. But we're saying to, I was saying to Russ earlier, uh, as much as I like fishing on the Umber, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you know, I'm not a prolific cod catcher by any stretch of anyone's imagination. I don't pretend to be. Um, and it's, it's all right, it's, there's some nice spots. I do like being on the beach. I do like nights like this on the beach, it's fantastic. I've just, yeah, not one of them anglers that catch a lot of fish. It's a good job I don't rely on it for food. Yeah, my missus should go off a nut. Don't get me wrong, I've had some decent sessions. During the summer I did alright. I my best some of my best sessions during the summer. Um, I always seem to feel is that just that one ingredient missing from the fishing. Send me from a crap angler to semi-decent. 
I mean, Russ are both was, was both on about it. We, we, we're both behind in uh, the cod stakes with everybody else. I mean, Vern smashing it. Um, Jimmy Cod bites. He's absolutely nailing it. I know Scott. He's he's done well. I've seen Scott for a while. Uh, Turksy Dave from across the way, and the Slayer. He takes great joy in telling us how many he's caught. We're just not in that bracket, I believe. <laughs> well, I'm certainly not. <laughs> oh, my word. Good job I enjoy it, innit? Uh, I'm always yawning, aren't I, on my videos? I do apologise. So don't forget, if you like my videos, if you like my videos, please subscribe. It's going well. I mean, I say that all the time, but it is really going well. Um, views on my videos are going up. I don't know how. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't... Here we are. I don't even put cod in my title. When I... <laughs> because I never get any. Um, but the support, the support's fantastic. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much, everybody. Um, and please continue to subscribe. It's absolutely amazing. Um, and subscribe to Van Sea Fishing as well. Good old Van across across the river there, doing well on the Umber. Uh, I'd call Fisherman of all Scott Senior. Please subscribe to him. One man and his rod, Russ. Jimmy. Uh, cod bites. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, cod bites. Jimmy cod bites. Give him a subscribe. UKC fishing with Big Dan. Give him a look. I know he does a lot on TikTok, but he's still active on uh, YouTube. And Levo, Levo's angling adventures. We haven't seen not from John for a while, so I hope you're all right, John. If you're watching this, look forward to seeing you out on the beach again. All the many others, all the others, you know. We are big channels, not by the long, by a long shot, or a long stretch of the whatever it is. We are what we are. That rod tip's just bouncing around. Anyway, that's enough of me waffling on. Hello, I'm here. Hello. I'll come back to you for what happens. <sighs> Excuse me, sorry. See you in a bit. I think I've just done a right bite. Left hand rod because the right hand rod's not in. But that was rattling a lot more than what it should have been. Mind you, it is uh, halfway to spare.
can't hear without air. Uh, sunset. Say again, Russ, sorry. a bite. Look at that. Hey, a beach cod. How nice is that? I'm over the moon. <laughs> Let's get it back. Hey, well, I'm over the moon. Absolutely chuff. 43 centimetres. Uh, very little chubby one. <laughs> but it went back. Put it back, it swam off van. Absolutely brilliant. So, buzzing. Let's see if we can get another one. Yeah, it's getting. Absolutely buzzing. <laughs> ah. That was this, that. 43 centimetre cod. Nice and plump. Great bite. I actually saw the bite, even in, the, even in this surf, it was just rattled really it was a really good pull down though really good um, and then pulled pulled to the uh, pulled to the right sprung the grippers on uh yeah that was on a, a load of lug slippy limpet style <laughs> cheers nathan oh uh oh name dropping terrible uh no absolutely buzzing I, yeah it was only on a boat to catch cod Look at that. I know it's nothing big, I don't get me wrong. I'm not pretending it was a beast, but the cod is a cod for me, I'm happy. I'd love a big one, I'd love a big cod. Because I will take one home. I want, like I said, I want one for my neighbour Ernie next door. Yeah. He's a filleting king. I can't fillet fish. It looks like I've gone at it with an old axle blade. Honestly. So any extra in any. Um he said he'd fill it in for us. So that'd be good. I just have to share the spoils. But I don't mind. I don't mind. He's a good lad, he's there. Be even better if you watch my videos. <laughs> I won't mind another one. I would, I would love a bigger. What do I class as big? Well, uh, five or six pounds is big for me. I was lucky actually because as I brought it in, it, uh, I lifted the, lifted the rod up to pull it in the, out the surf, got it on the beach and the up pulled. <laughs> I'd have been devastated with that. But that happened to me last time. When me and Vern was here. All I saw was a massive mouth. And then my hooks come flying at me. Oh, I would love another one. Let's up, eh? Let's up. Right, time for a bit of a bit change, I think. Uh, I haven't seen any rattles as such just to say smashing it up but we'll get it in and we'll have a look
temperature's dropping now. <laughs> it's freezing. <laughs> hey, see you in a bit. Right, gonna bring this one in. I'm only fishing with one rod now. Um, Shall we get your taps?
maybe I'm leaving that a little bit too long, getting all taffled up. That temperature's dropped now. I'm gonna have to put my big kite on, I think. That knows. around like a good one so right I'll see you in a bit Look at the size of that whiting! That's massive! <laughs> Beauty! That's my first waiting in ages. That's not a bad size as well. <laughs> Let's get it back. Too, too good. That water's cold. That water is cold. <laughs> I was good to saw the bite as well on that one, so I was quite chuffed. Excuse me. Just need a big cod now. Come on, beggars. So I'll give you some uh, rod action. Great terminology. Is 
dad's on the ebb now. So yeah, decent waiting. I know you can't see me. Um, pretty chuffed with that. Take that all day long. Saw the bike as well, in between the swells, surf, uh, whatever. new leader all on today pretty chuffed with that then a new knot as well spider rich well played this light's failing as well what a nightmare I still didn't buy a brand new light I should have done you alright Marcus you had enough? Ah, oh, good. <laughs> good man. What a like. Down for a new light. I'm just losing power sharpie. I'm pretty tight though. See Yorkshireman in me. I will use it until it absolutely has no power ever left again. the fish came on fresh low on, uh, on a panel rig on a short panel rig I made actually so pretty chuffed with that Seems to be staying out straight actually now. Are you using seven? Yeah, yeah. Uh, have you broken the seat? Because <laughs> it should now be pulling to the left, shouldn't it? It should do, yeah. Yeah, now it's ebbing, yeah. But it's not. Because <laughs> <laughs> what it wants, don't it? What was that? A good size whiting? Whiting, yeah, decent whiting. Good bite as well. A, a, a rockling <laughs> beats the blank though, mate. I'll take a snotty any day, me, mate, if I'm blanking. No. Yeah. I mean, if what I'm told is you, like, come over here. 
Where they cut, aren't they? Well, that's just it. The bottom hole is going to be rocking in and about. The cut, eh? The rocking is across the river. Yeah. Top, yeah. Top. yeah, that's what I've heard. By, by northerners, by uh, Geordie Nights. You get a big and don't you? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm going to give it till about eight. Yeah, I think that's what I'm feeling. Yeah, about, yeah. Eight. about eight o'clock. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Nice. 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 Nice crowd. Right, so the final bit of the video, we'll have some gratuitous rod action. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Oh dear, shouldn't really be it. No, it's been an enjoyable session, I've enjoyed it with the lads, had a good laugh. We haven't planked and that's the main thing. We've got a codling, so that's the third one this winter, so... Buzzing, happy as a pig in the proverbial muck. Come on, one more decent pull down, let's have it. Don't know what I'm having for tea tonight. Might do myself some proper chips in the Ninja. Because they are lovely. The only downside to it is eat eight pieces of bread I bloody have. <sighs> Shouldn't eat bread. It is brown bread, though. Me Christmas.
sad skull kicking up of folks. Oh dear. If that was a bite, oh, I'd be all over that. So quick back to me. <laughs> I'll watch the rod for us, don't worry. Yeah, so um, I was just having a look then. I think, I can't remember his last name. It was uh, one of my subscribers called Gary. Left a comment. Um, and I think it's quite valid, to be fair. Um, you know, would you be happy me showing you the rigs I'm using and the, the way I bait up? I don't, I don't want to teach anybody to suck eggs. I'm, I'm not the most experienced. You know, I just do it like, like I see fit. Um, sorry about that. I thought I had a bait then. But is it something you want to see? I mean, do you want to see me do a rig video, or are you just happy for me to show you the rigs on, on the videos where I'm fishing? Let us know. Let me know. I'll, if that's what you want, I will gladly show you rigs and baiting up. And, but a lot of you guys, I mean, uh, yeah, I think Gary said he's, he's not been sea fishing long, which is fair enough. Now, I don't profess to be any expert. In fact, if you watch most of my videos, I'm pretty crap at sea fishing myself. No, I'm not saying that you lot are crap because, you know, you all catch a lot more cod than me. I just enjoy sea fishing. But yeah, <sighs> on the downtime, I think it is, on the boring bits, <laughs> where it's just me yakking. But yeah, but I was, I mean, to be fair, and like I said earlier, Gemini sent us a load of kit for me to review. A uh, load of tackle components and what have you, bits and pieces. Absolutely fantastic it was. Um, now I'm gonna get myself a Gemini rig jig but, you know, I'll gladly put a couple of videos out there just showing, you know, quick videos showing you the, the rigs I use. And they're only basic pulley rigs. Um, and my favourite two-up clip now. But yeah, I'll definitely show that if that's what you want. Let me know in the comments below, please. My toes are cold. Oh, my toes are cold. I've got two pairs of socks on them as well. Yeah, so thank you, Gemini. Thank you, Sukuma, for sending us the hooks uh, and the shock leader as well. I'm going to be testing that out on my next video. Uh, wow, is that a bite or what? Sorry. And thank you, Cox and Rolf, for sending us some hooks and bits and pieces. I'm, I'm how actually good, using this. Yeah. I don't know how good the videos are to watch. Because to us, we were there. See, I've been getting there. And then we got. Oh. Yeah, but he's got a stiff rod, same as me. Yeah. No, but mine. Heavily stiff one, isn't it? Not a stiff one. Oh. I might have to go as well. I want to. Oh. Well, 
if you lot are going to start catching now, I'm going to start, I'm going to start fishing on that. I'm not going to bait out this entire time. You haven't. No, I know. Seen the bite, that was good. Oh, the bite. Yeah. yeah, I better check it. See a bit, See a bit. I've oh, seen the bite. It was a good little bite. Only a small white in, but three to the good. Up here's Larry. Let's get this back. Get me home. It's time for tea. Here's Larry. It's cold now, it's bitter. Uh, so yeah, this has been South Wiverency. Really enjoyed it. Oh, there's a fish. Get in. I'm gonna go have a look, be right back. So yeah, some excitement down the beach, brilliant. Not gonna say what, that's Russ's video. But pulled out of the bag at the end, well done. Well done. So yeah, this has been South Wimmer and Sea on a cold and frosty chilly night. And it's coming up to Christmas. I'm really looking forward to it. Looking forward to some time off with the family. Uh, and do some more fishing as well. So I hope you've enjoyed the video. I've really enjoyed being here. Uh, and I look forward to the next one. Hopefully we're back on the beach. Take care all. See you soon.